what up dudes i keep saying that i'm going to post a video once i edit it and everything but i haven't edited anything because my phone keeps running out of storage no matter how many apps i delete no matter how many pictures i delete no matter how many clips i delete like everything just you know the universe does not want me to edit anything the universe wants me to be raw baby so i'm gonna be raw this is chip Chip is my little puppy that I got for free. I got her for free um, by a customer that came into where I work at the gas station. Um, he was like holding her. She was a little tiny baby, fits in the palm of my hand. And he was like, I was like, oh my God, cute dog, can I touch it? And he was like, yeah, do you want it? I'm trying to get rid of it. And I was like, what? No way, how much? And he was like, for free. And I was like, what? So I was like, um, should I do it? Should I do it? So then I asked my manager, he was like, do whatever you want, man. I'm like, who cares? And I was like, ahem, thanks for the help. And anyway, so I like took it or whatever. Sorry, my face hurts because I've been blowing my nose all day because I think I'm getting sick. I have a scratchy throat and um, I've been wiping my nose a lot because I've been cold. I think I'm getting a cold. I hope I'm not getting sick. I couldn't even enjoy my day. Anyway, this is chippy. I've had Chippy for like a month or so now. Um, I got her when she was eight weeks. I thought she was actually a boy because when he gave her to me, he was like, yeah, that's the boy. That's, I got the sister in the car or wherever. He's, he's like, I have the sister somewhere or whatever. So I was like, what? And so for like two days, I was like, I, his name is Chip. I've been calling it a he, blah, blah, blah. Next thing I know, I, I was actually like taking her to work with me because she was just a baby. I couldn't leave her unattended. So um, I was taking her to work with me on the overnight shifts because nobody's gonna say anything, honestly. And she was small enough to where I could fit her inside my jacket. So I was like incognito mode. Nobody has to know. So anyway, a customer came in. They asked me how old it was and they were like, oh, I have a Chihuahua too, same age, blah, blah, blah. And they were like, you got that for free? Like people pay for that. And I was like, no way, so you're telling me I can flip this? Just kidding. I wouldn't. I was already attached. Thanks. Thanks, Jibby. Ah! Thanks. Don't attack me. Anyways, she likes to attack my hair. So, I decided to keep her, um, got her her shots and everything. My boyfriend helped me. He did that for Christmas. Um, I just been taking care of her snuggling with her a lot um i thought she was a boy so i named her chip but once i found out that customer was like that's a chick dude because he looked at her and apparently you could tell by just this area right here and i didn't know that because i didn't really know that much about dogs like that and so um i found out it was a girl so i'm not gonna change its name like i already named it chip so her name is Chipney Spears after Britney Spears, Chip Lee Spears. Sometimes I call her Jib. Sometimes I call her Jibbles. Sometimes I call her Jibbles McGee. Sometimes I call her Jibber McJibberstein. Um, I just call her a lot of different names. Um, I call her Jibbly. I call her Jibblies, believe it or not. Uh, ah! Har. Har. Still do him a little chippy chip. Anyway, so yeah. Um, I have a dog now. Um, what else is new? I got a freaking promotion at my job. And I'm not on overnights anymore. So that's cool. But that's just barely starting like tomorrow. I'm going to actually have to be there in the daytime. That's going to be weird to me because I never have to do that. But um, it's going to be a long shift. I'm going to hate myself. But we're going to get her done, baby. I got off at Duncan today at like noon because I worked two jobs. So after that, I had to go to my other job at the K. And, you know, I had to do paperwork. I had to yell at some people, crush chicks and break necks, you know. So um, hopefully my life will get a little bit less stressful because I won't be sleepy. I won't be like wasting a whole day sleeping because I haven't been able to create my art because I'm always tired, because I'm always working, and I was working overnight, and I was having to sleep during the daytime, and I also have to have my kid, and I also have to pay attention to her, and I also have a lot of places that my mind has to be, and you know, sometimes, sometimes, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, okay? And um, 
hopefully my life gets a little bit better now because I'll be off the overnight and I'm sorry to the person who's gonna have to do the overnight because I'm not doing it anymore um hopefully it works out I don't want to jinx anything honestly I'm trying not to jinx anything I'm crossing my toes right now I'm even crossing my imaginary fingers in my head like I'm hoping this works out because honestly I was doing it I was literally going from the overnight job to my Duncan job so I was staying up for like 24 hours I was being freaking drained of my life I did that for a very very long time like I can't even tell you how long it was because that's how long I was doing it, it just became normal to me and people be like when are you gonna sleep and I'm like when I die you know so um I hope that will help me and what else is new? I've been co-parenting my daughter with her father. I'm kind of supporting him a little bit. Um, you know, gotta help a brother out. Can't let your people suffer, you know? So I gotta work hard so my people don't suffer because I would love my people to be okay. You know, I don't like to see my people down. So I gotta do what I gotta do. If I have to miss out on some sleep and work extra hard and sacrifice, sacrifice, and that's what I have to do. But now that, you know, I'll be off all overnights, maybe I can create more. And um, I'm probably not going to edit any videos because honestly, I like to edit. But before when I was editing, nobody was appreciating my art. So I'm not going to edit anything anymore. We're going off dome, baby. We're going off dome. This is who I am. This is what I look like. I just got home. I just got off of work. It's 4.08. I spent like an hour in traffic. I got off at 3. I got in my car at 3.10 when I started driving. Literally. So what I do, I like literally have to drive all the time in traffic. It takes me a long time. And the, that's the beauty of living in a small town. See, usually in Texas, when I lived in Texas, time lasted so long like the hours just felt so the days were longer but i have to literally drive like 20 30 40 minutes depending on traffic to the town that i work at and then drive to another town that's the same distance somehow on the map but i have to drive there to work and then i gotta come back here and then i gotta walk up three flights of stairs and my body is tired but we do it we're getting through it every day that I like accomplish is like a new mountain and I just keep getting it and I'm like I got this I got this nothing can bring me down <laughs> and people be like how do you do it and I'm like honestly I cry sometimes in the shower I do but you gotta do what you gotta do no excuses I don't know why I'm like this either because I have such a like no excuse mentality like when people are like I'm tired I'm like have you had to work 24 hours straight have you you know what in Russia they shoot people who have excuses like this you know <sighs> but um yeah I'm just we're gonna see how this goes it is literally the middle of January I can't believe it when I blinked my eyes New Year's was over and it, it is the middle of January. I said, oh, I'm gonna try to update everybody and let everybody know what I'm doing, blah, blah, blah. Did I update you when I moved out of my situation that I was in, in 2023, when I was living with my, you know, daughter's father and we were co-parenting and living under the same roof? I didn't update you, but you know, I basically was the sugar mama for a little bit. I had to do what I had to do. He was watching the kids. Um, but he kept getting sick a lot and um, eventually I just had to go out on my own and it's what I'm doing now and I'm working every single day to pay and to make it out here on these streets. Can you quit doing things? Quit doing things. Little chippy. Little chippy. So yeah, we just got home. We're gonna go and they're so cute. Uh, we're gonna go hang out with um a person and um kick it over there i want to try to update y'all on what's going on in my day i'm just gonna i'm gonna try my best okay guys because uh really i feel like this is for me this time i don't want to do it for anyone else like i find myself interesting i watch myself 
like honestly like i have so many videos on my phone and i won't delete them because i find them entertaining for myself like and i don't feel like performing for anybody i don't want to perform i'm not here to perform anything i want everything to be authentic i want everything to just be real can i put you in all my glasses stop chewing on stuff how do i get her to stop chewing on stuff she chews on everything um uh, so yeah this is what we're doing this is chippy if you haven't seen her in 2024 this is chippy when i had her she fit inside my sweater that's how tiny she was and now she's getting big before my eyes how dare she how dare you who told you to grow who told you to grow who who did it who did little chippy who did it little chippy so um yeah 2024 we're gonna make we're gonna make this work okay hold me to it hold me accountable i want you to hold me accountable okay i just wanted to say hi and that is my 2024 update S still working still a little spicy taco chip still awesome still a cool mom we're out here surviving vibing living the life -ing. all right peace